Hello everyone and welcome back to Project Fern. I'm Danny and today's video is going to be on the Mitsubishi Evo 6 again and we're going to be getting the hydraulic lifters done. I need to go over and get the car now and take it back over to AMD Limited. I've got it booked in. Yeah, the hydraulic lifters are really tappity, quite annoying. They've got a 1mm hole in the top. The, the new ones that they do at Mitsubishi now have a 3mm hole in them. They, allowed, they allow a better flow of oil through, stop to tappity noise. Um, while AMD have got the car as well, I know I had the air conditioning fixed the other week, but it stopped working again. It's as if the system's over pressurizing. Um, the compressor and the air con fan just cut off and it stops working and you leave it, get to it the next day, it'll run for a bit and then cut off again. So they're going to have a look at that for me and hopefully get it sorted. It's been a bit annoying with the weather that we've had and not being able to have the air conditioning on, but this is what happens with all the cars. I'm not bothered as long as it gets fixed. So yeah, next stop's get over to the unit and go and get the Evo and I'll show you the Tappity hydraulic lifters. I don't know if you can pick the Tappity noise up on the video, but I'm gonna spin the microphone around now and then you can have a listen for yourself. And fingers crossed, when I pick the car up, it'll be gone. I've had the phone call from Danny over AMD Limited. The Evo's ready to collect. The engine apparently is now totally silent. Now the lifters have been fitted and the aircon is fully fixed as well. So I'm gonna head over there, pick the car up, see what the damage is in terms of cost and see exactly what's been done to the car to get it all fixed, sounding mint and the air conditioning working. So I'll check back in in a minute when I picked it up and we'll see how everything sounds and how everything feels. I can't tell you how quiet this car is now the lifters have been done. It's near enough silent, especially with the standard exhaust on the car. The air conditioning is super cold as well. I've had to put another compressor on the car, which seems to have fixed it. It was a dodgy refurbished compressor, which is such a shame because it looked the part, but it was no good. So another Evo 6 compressor has been put on the car. It's super, super cold now. It's cutting in when it should. Uh, the other one was nowhere near as cold as this, so it must have just been knackered from the start. It had totally seized up again. The clutch had locked on. Um, I'm just happy that the air conditioning is fixed. It's not been cheap. On the air conditioning now, I've had the compressor done three times. I've had the condenser done. I've had the air con fan done. I've had that dry air, whatever it was, that little canister done. But it regassed about 15 times. But hopefully now, this is it. It's all working. It's freezing cold. And yeah, I'm happy. So on the hot days, I can enjoy the car. I know it's got a sunroof, but that doesn't help when you get into a car and it's been roasting all day. For the hydraulic lifters, it's totally changed this car. It was very tappity, it was horrendous. And now it's silent. You can hear the injectors ticking a little bit, but I'm not bothered by that. You can't hear the horrible noise of the, the lifters drumming away. And yeah, it just makes the car feel, sound, and like look a lot better really. I'm gonna pull over in a second and show you under the bonnet and show you how quiet it is. I've just pulled over now to show you how quiet it is underneath. A million times better no clicking from the compressor now either the car feels like a different car it sounds like a different car when you're driving and you pull over at traffic lights it feels like the car stalled it's that quiet but yeah absolutely over the moon thanks to Danny at AMD limited that's another video on the evil in the bag we've got the air conditioning finally working and fixed second time third time round, whatever it is and we've got the hydraulic lifters done as well. What a difference that makes to the car for what it costs to actually have them done. And yeah, it's finally getting there. I nipped it over to the body shop near AMD Limited to get a price and get it booked in for all the bits. It's gonna be having the front bumper repainted, a side skirt repainted. There's a bit of bubbling on the back door, which I'm gonna be having done. The tops of the doors, the satin black, I'm gonna be getting done. And I'm also gonna be getting the car fully detailed really cut compound whatever you want to call it machine buffed up and get it looking amazing again um, hope you've enjoyed this video hope you're still tuning in anyone who's uh, watches these videos who's not subscribed please make sure you hit the subscribe button all those people who are already subscribed thanks a lot for keep returning i know i'm not making as many videos as i used to but i'm going to be doing in the next few months when i get stuck back into it again i've just had other things on 
always hit the like button if you enjoyed the video if not hit the dislike video tell me what you think any comments put them in the comment section below and i'll see you in the next video